Welcome, my name is Alex Cobb. I'm the CTO of Vestas Global Advisors. And this is a demonstration of the Vestas Progressive Web App, which we developed using the Kony Visualizer running on the Kony App Fabric platform. This is our Progressive Web App, and what you're looking at at this screen is a view of that app through a mobile device. This is an iOS device. So you can see this is essentially a landing page and shows you a basic menu of the contents of the application. As I drill into the About uh, section, you'll see it provides an overview of our company, your vision, design, origins of, of who we are and how we came together to form the company. Uh, and you can scroll down and see some additional information, some you know, legal disclosure uh, and such about our business. Going back to the main screen, um, we'll then click into the uh, services section, and this describes the services uh, that we provide our sellers, as well as the services that we provide to our buyers. And you can see in that uh, representation that we've uh, um, formatted the screen so all the content neatly fits into pages on the mobile device. And I'll show you how that will also fit neatly into any size device, any size screen. Uh, further through the application, you'll see that we have a list of contacts and these contacts are interactive. You can click on the phone numbers to miss a phone call. You can click on the email address to send an email or link out to, uh, to LinkedIn to get more information about uh, the members of our company. The last item in the menu is a link to the Vestas collection. As we click through, we're presented with a gallery of photos for each of the properties along with their name and location and if applicable listing price. Additional buttons at the bottom provide access to more information, either listing information or a link to email Vestas for more information, as well as the ability to send this link to someone else via email. If we click on the share link, it pulls up your email, pre-populated with a link to the app, and you type in your address and send. As we browse through the collection and, and see the different properties um, that we're uh, spotlighting here, you can see that this is really still very much looking like a web application. Uh, you can see the, the browser uh, address bar at the top and some additional buttons at the bottom. One of the things we can do with the progressive web app is that we can click on this button at the lower center to open up uh, this menu system that allows us to save to the home screen. And that's pre-populated with the icon that we've selected. And now that allows us to go and click directly on that icon to open up this, uh, this progressive web app and take me directly into the app. So now when I'm browsing uh, through these different property photos, you can see that we're just in the shell of the app. You're no longer taking up screen real estate with the address bar. You're no longer looking at this as a web page. This is really a progressive web app now. Um, additionally, the ability to leverage the Progressive Web Apps caching mechanism allows us to put the app into an airplane mode, and I can then open that app from that Progressive Web App icon button on the desktop or on the home screen. And in airplane mode, as you can see now, I'm able to go open up uh, and browse through the collection. Basically, any page that I've seen before will be locally cached, and I'm able to see that page. Let's switch gears and move to the desktop. We'll continue our scenario by receiving the email that we previously sent. And as we click on that email link, we'll open up the same progressive web app, but we'll open it in a browser on the desktop. You can see those same pages are now rendered to take full advantage of the larger screen real estate, but still fit perfectly within the frame of the pages and snap from page to page. You can really see the advantage of, of having a larger screen as we flip through the gallery of these photos. And ultimately that's our intent to allow users to explore and browse on the device, but ultimately drive to a more lean-in, fully embraced experience looking at big, rich media on the desktop, and then ultimately reaching out to us to request more information or to continue to share these exceptional properties with their friends or with their colleagues or anyone who's interested. Thank you very much for your time. I appreciate all the support from Connie, and I really encourage you all to go off and build your next progressive web app. Cheers. Thank you.